say hello to Mahula. Hello, kitty. Aloha, oi. Aloha. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Welcome back to Long Haul Healing, a safe place for COVID sufferers, survivors, and long haulers. My name is Nikki, and in today's video, I'll be going over how I stopped hair loss from long COVID. So, you are probably wondering to yourself, what the hell would I know about hair loss, since I seem to have lots of it. Well. Let me tell you. Yes, I know it doesn't look like I've lost hair or a lot of it, but believe you me, I lost over half my hair. So yes, my hair used to be twice as thick as this, but thankfully I am a descendant of Maui and I've been blessed with having thick ass hybrid hair. So within the first two months, I noticed I started shedding more hair than usual which was definitely concerning because I'd heard from other long haulers that they also started to lose massive amounts of hair. So I kind of knew what was coming. And in order to combat the hair loss, I started incorporating, of course, juicing. If you watched any of my other videos, I am quite an advocate for juicing. Um, so yeah, I started incorporating juicing into my daily diet. And well, let's just say like, two, three, four weeks later, I was still losing hair, like handfuls of hair, for example. Say hello to my hairball. I grew it myself. I grew these too. Disclaimer, I am not a medical professional. I am just me. And this is purely based off of my own experience. I do wanna say that I did this without medical supervision, which I do not advise. Do this with medical approval or supervision or at the very least um, consult with your doctor or physician before doing a juice fast especially if you've never done a juice fast before so yeah after losing a lot of hair for a few weeks i knew i needed to step up my game and be more proactive with my health so i actually ended up doing a juice fast I juice fasted for 14 days and I'm not gonna lie, it wasn't easy. Well, I guess the first week was kind of easy considering I was unconscious for most of it. The struggle bus of fatigue hit me like a But by the end of the first week, I definitely noticed my hair loss wasn't as much as it was before. Brushing my hair before, I'd lose this much. And then at the end of the first week, brushing my hair, I lost that much. The second week was harder than the first, probably because I was conscious for much more of it. And also the food cravings were pretty strong, but it was all worth it in the end because by the end of the second week, I was actually back to my pre-COVID amount of normal hair loss. Oh, yay! If you see me looking, I'm reading my notes because I'm a long hauler. My memory is still crap. Oh yeah, I forgot. So another main reason, well, my hair was the main reason why I decided to do the juice fast, but also because my nails, my nails, I noticed were also a lot thinner and more brittle. And it was like, anytime I touch a doorknob or open the fridge, a nail would break or crack. Back to the results. By the end of the second week, my nails were noticeably stronger, um, even now. They're noticeably stronger. Look at them. They're beautiful. Oh, another huge, huge improvement was that by the end of the second week, I was headache free. I actually ended up going eight days headache free. And if you are a long hauler with chronic headaches, daily headaches, like I was for the first like three, three and a half months of my long haul life, uh, this was amazing. Now that it's been a few weeks since my juice fast. I still actually only get occasional headaches and they aren't anywhere near as long or as severe as they used to be. For the first like three months, I would have well daily headaches, but a lot of them, I'd say about half of them would be like migraine level headaches. 
Other significantly improved symptoms are tachycardia. I noticed that pre-juice fast, oh, why did I say that so weird? <clears throat> that pre-juice fast, my resting heart rate, like sitting down or laying down, would be in the 80s to 100s. And by the end of the second week, I dipped down into the 50s. I was at like a couple times I looked down and checked my little dealy do for my heart rate. And one time it was like 58 and another time it was 59, but they like averaged in the 60s. I was down into the 60s, which was really cool to see. Other improved symptoms, of course, were less anxiety and depression. Oh, more energy. I had more spurts of energy, which was really convenient, especially for juicing, because juicing does take a lot out of you. Um, but even so, I still tired easily. But when I did have energy, I had battle, battle, be I had better mental clarity, better mental clarity and alertness. So obviously I had less brain fog. Um, I also had less muscle and joint pain, which was also really nice to be able to go up the stairs like pre-juice fast I'd have to walk up the stairs like one step at a time with both feet but now I can like you know like, do, 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 like walk up normally so if you are wondering or if you are losing hair and are wondering or even if you like do it for the headaches if you have daily headaches just juice for a little bit within the first week I did notice that my headaches did improve so even if you don't do it for 14 days, just try giving it a week or do it for 10 days and see how that helps. I can't stress enough how much peace of mind I have now that I'm like even weeks after I'm only losing, like I'm losing normal amounts of hair. So give it a try. Let me know how it works. I'm so excited for you to try this if you do choose to. All right, y'all. Hola, hello, kitty says, Make good choices and remember to hydrate. Aloha. Oh, yeah.